Welcome to Foxify's Build for Success series by Foxecom. If you're ready to take your online store to the next level, stick around, because today, we are going to show you how to build a stunning landing page using Foxify Page Builder. We'll be creating a page inspired by this modern look from Luxie Hair. Whether you're looking to showcase your best sellers, promote special offers, or make a great first impression, Foxify makes it easy as one, two, three. Let's dive in. From the Foxify dashboard, click Create Page and select the page type. You can quick start with a pre-made template or create a blank page. In this example, we will create a landing page from scratch. Give the page a name, select the page layout, and get ready to bring our vision to life. The first section features a full-width video with different versions for desktop and mobile views. To achieve this design, let's add a blank section and set a video as the section background. Let's set our section container setting to full width. To save time, use the keyboard shortcut Ctrl or Command D to duplicate the section. Use the visibility settings to customize the display of both sections. Show the original section on desktop view only and the duplicated section only on mobile view. Following the Video Hero section is a compelling copy that highlights the brand's product message. To achieve this, we'll add a clean centered text using the Stack feature with a text element. Stack maintains perfect positioning, ensuring the elements won't overlap or shift, even when the screen is resized. Once we've added the text element, let's style it now. Next, we'll create a section with a clean and engaging design, featuring two main parts, a large, high-quality image on the left and interactive collapsible tabs on the right that briefly explain the product options. To achieve this layout, we'll use a grid element with two columns. First, let's add an image to the first cell and adjust its width to take up 100% of the cell ensuring a full and responsive display. To quickly adjust the spacing between the columns, drag the pink strip between them. In the second column, we'll place several elements like a heading, text, and collapsible content. For precise positioning and smooth alignment, we'll use Stack, allowing us to neatly arrange these nested elements. Now, let's add our text elements to the Stack for the heading and description. Once they're in place, we'll style the text just like we did earlier. This includes adjusting the font, size, and spacing to ensure a consistent and polished look throughout the section. Set the size of the stack by defining its width and height. Align the nested elements within the stack using the auto layout settings. Next, we'll add a collapsible element to our stack. This feature lets you present information in a compact and organized way. Here we are adding four collapsible items. You can easily manage and style your collapsible items like their headings and content, ensuring they match your brand style. We add some padding to our element header and the element content using the design tab. Now, let's add some titles and content to the collapsible items. Start by selecting the item you want to customize. 
For each item, we're using stack to arrange the content. Each collapsible item will have the same layout, consisting of text, an image, and a button that links to the desired page. To save time, we'll customize the first item and then duplicate it for the others. Next, we'll position the button over the image. To do this, frame the image and button together, then set constraints to control where the button appears within the frame. Fine-tune our element. Once you're finished, you can duplicate the stack and use the same design for the below collapsible items. The next section showcases a set of four products, each presented with an engaging image of a model with the respective solution, along with a short description below. To achieve this, we'll use a stack for the section header and a grid layout with four columns. In each grid cell, we'll include an image, text content, and a button. Let's customize the elements in the cell. Since all the cells share the same design, we can simply customize one, then duplicate it across the remaining cells. After duplicating, we'll just update the content for each product. Let's move on to the next section, which features a before and after comparison image slider. These images demonstrate the transformation after using the products. For this section, we'll use a stack element, nesting a heading for the section header and a carousel element. First, customize the heading as desired, then add a carousel to the stack. A carousel works similarly to a grid with cells, but it allows viewers to slide through the content using navigation when there are more cells than columns. We'll add some left and right padding to the stack and adjust the gap between the columns for a clean layout. In this case, we'll set it up with three columns. For the image comparison slider, we'll use the before-after image element. Adjust the image sizes to suit your design, and upload your images. The slider feature allows viewers to drag and compare the before and after images, highlighting the product's transformative effect. Below the images, add a text element for the product description. Once the first column is complete, you can use the keyboard shortcut Ctrl or Command and D to duplicate it for other columns. This will save time, and you can simply replace the content in each column with the respective images and text. A theme is like the backbone of your store, defining its overall look, feel, and functions. We proudly introduce you, Zest, the one and only theme for mobile commerce success. A solid base for your online store that is more flexible than flexibility. Create an immersive experience in product discovery. Showcase your products in style in a breeze. Boost your marketing efforts with Zest's built-in tools, empowering you to engage with your audience and drive sales. And especially, built with the success of mobile commerce in mind. It's time to create an incredible shopping experience with minimal setup time and ensure a hassle-free experience for your customers. Ready to take your mobile commerce game to the next level? Join the revolution with Zest. Let's get back to building our landing page with Foxify Page Builder. The next section we're creating effectively presents the how to install guide for different products in organized and visually appealing tabs. This lets viewers easily switch between different product instructions. Let's see how we can create a similar section using Foxify. 
Start with adding a stack to the section. Set the stack to be full width and add some left and right padding to it. Next, add a text element for the section heading. Now, add a tabs element to the stack. In the design settings for the tabs, you'll be able to customize the container, the tab headers, and the tab titles independently. For the tab titles, add a border around them and set a background color for the active state to highlight the selected tab. To refine the design further, we'll remove the gap between the parent tab's container and apply some custom CSS to disable the underline effect when hovering over the tab buttons. This will align the design more closely with our desired look and feel. For our first tab content, we will use another tabs element to structure the information. This approach allows you to neatly organize the product guides while ensuring the layout remains user-friendly. Let's style our child tabs just like we did with the parent tabs earlier. To adjust the gap between these child tab headers, we'll add some custom CSS. You can find all the custom code used for today's page in the video description below. Now, let's move on to customizing the content for each child tab. All the child tabs will share a similar layout. We'll horizontally stack a video element on the left and a nested stack on the right for the content. Each content section will include a heading, a description, and collapsible items, similar to the third section we previously created. You can always refer back to it using the video timestamps. That's it for the first parent tab. For the second and third parent tab, we'll use a stack that includes a large embedded YouTube video, a heading text, and a grid with five columns for the detailed instructions. Let's start by customizing our first cell, and once it's done, we can simply duplicate it for the rest of the grid. We're using the keyboard shortcut Ctrl D to quickly duplicate the selected element. Drag the duplicated stacks to each of our cells using the Layers tab and replace them with their content. You can also copy the style of one element and paste it if you want to customize another element the same.
The next section we will be creating showcases a combination of text and video content in a slider format, highlighting a personal story to engage viewers. To achieve this, we will use a carousel element. First, set the carousel size and center it on the page. For the layout, we'll configure it with one column. Set the carousel to autoplay, but also allow manual navigation using the arrows. Foxify offers the options to change the navigation icon and also the type, whether to be inline or floating. Once the carousel is set up, let's start adding content. Since we want to feature a video alongside text, we'll add a stack for the content and a video element, stacking them horizontally. Once the first slide is complete, simply duplicate it for the second slide and replace the content with new text and video. And that's it. Your carousel is ready. Following our video, with text carousel section is another product list, similar to the one we created at the beginning of the page. However, this version has a hover effect that displays a second image when the user hovers over each product. To achieve this, we'll add two images in each cell and frame them together, with one image on top of the other. Next, we'll use the custom code modal to apply custom CSS that triggers the hover effect. Once that's set, we'll use the stack element to add the content below the images. After customizing the first cell, we can simply duplicate it for the rest of the grid, as all the cells will share the same styling. This will save time and maintain a consistent layout across the product list. We're almost finished with our landing page. The second to last section features a large, centered image. 
To create this section, you can either use an image element or save time by using one of our pre-designed sections, such as Hero or Slideshow, depending on your needs. Finally, our last section includes text and buttons, focusing on the customization and personalized support the brand offers. This section encourages visitors to engage and explore further. Now that our page is ready in desktop view, make sure to adjust it for each breakpoint to ensure that all elements maintain perfect alignment and composition across different devices. With Foxify, you can create stunning and effective landing pages for any niche. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more helpful e-commerce content.